What's going on YouTube? It's Maddie with Fusero Fitness and I have an extremely short video sharing a cue with you that I read somewhere. I don't remember where, but it's always stuck in my head, so I'm not taking credit for this, but I do think it will have some value to your training as it has mine and also other clients that I train. And it's simply referring to scapular retraction, but the cue is put your shoulder blades in your back pocket. Now, a lot of people, mainly during pressing exercises such as a bench press, they end up feeling the pain or the burn or whatever the case may be in their anterior delt, in their front part of the shoulder, and they're not feeling it in their chest. Their pecs are not firing correctly for the exercise. So what can you do to fix that? A lot of people tell these people asking the question, scapular retraction, bring your shoulder blades together. But they also don't explain what that entails. When you tell someone to bring their shoulder blades together, a lot of times they do this. Now what they're actually doing, if I turn around, is shrugging their traps. As you can see, my traps are shrugged up, which is not putting my chest in the most beneficial position. But when you give them the cue, put your shoulder blades in your back pocket, it will give them the ability to think, bring the shoulder blades back, but also bring them down. And notice how the chest rises when you go back and down. So now the chest is at a way better position for pressing and you'll be using much more of the pec and involving the muscle that you're targeting, which will be the pec for pressing, and you'll feel it a lot less in your shoulders. This doesn't only go for pressing exercises, but we're using that as an example. So again, that cue is put your shoulder blades in your back pocket, scapular retraction or bringing your shoulder blades back. Don't forget to bring them down as well. So I'm gonna show you one more quick time the mistake that some people make when they hear bring your shoulder blades together and that will conclude the video. This is what most people do when you tell them to retract their scapula or bring their shoulder blades together. They end up pinching their traps and shrugging rather than going back and down, which I'm going to demonstrate here. So notice how we bring the shoulder blades together and then go down. This will also help benefit you in your pressing exercises. As you can notice, when you squeeze down, the lats flare out, which will help give you power on your bench press. This if it fits your macro shit, everywhere you look on Facebook, YouTube videos, on Instagram, people taking pictures of their Pop-Tarts, tagging it if it fits your macros, people messaging me and asking me questions, asking does it work? Can they see results if they follow if it fits your macros?